I did $496,000 in sales in 2018. I said, dude, you should have called me. I'd have given you the five grand. What the hell? <laughs> and he said, well, what would I have done for you, accounting? I said, dude, I don't even care. You should have just called me. I'd have just given you the five grand. Right? You've got to hit that number. Okay? Now, I, now, that's not why I tell you the story, though. I tell you the story because I asked him, I said, dude, but honestly, I know I'm joking a little bit, but you hit 496. I said, what's your goal for 2019? He said, well, I, I really want to do the 500,000. <laughs> I said, what in the hell? Right? That is completely, I said, dude, thank God you're on this call today, right? Because I swear, what your concept is of what you're capable of between the beginning of this call and the end of this call is about to change big time. Because that was some bullshit, right? I did 496, and next year I'm going to do 500. <laughs> wow, that's some bad thinking, right? So, and I, so I asked him. I said, all right, well, he's doing CFO services. He's actually on the live stream right now. And I said, okay, so, well, all of 2019, you know, I know beginning of this call, you want to do 500. How many clients could you onboard a month? You've got a team. He's, you know, you've already got a couple people working with you. Too many, but you've got a couple people working with you. How many clients could you onboard a month at 1,000 a month or more? And he said, well, I've got to think about this. He's calculating his head. He's got the staff. Okay. I've got this other thing. Well, it is tax season. Okay. okay. Uh, I don't know. Maybe, maybe two clients a month. Right, which is a problem, and we'll talk about capacity this weekend. Two clients a month, right? Two clients per month. That's 24 clients for a year. Now, and I asked them, I said, at 1,000 a month or more, right? So, and, and I didn't specify what particular levels of service, what the scope is going to be, what the price is going to be, and we'll, we're going to talk about all that this weekend, but I just don't think about mechanics yet. Right? Don't think about all the bullshit and the mechanics and the hiring and the onboarding, all that. We're going to get there, right? But like right now, I want to focus on the big picture. And he kept on doing that. He kept on saying, going back to the details. Because, I mean, I'm an accountant too, so I get addicted to those freaking details and the mechanics and everything. But when you're thinking about sales and you're thinking about the long term and growing the business, you've got to be careful not to do that too much. So 24 clients over the course of the year. Okay, so at 1000 a month a pop, right? That would basically have, if, if we add those two, just two a month, that would increase our monthly recurring revenue by 2,000 a month over the course of that period.